picked up the kids and we just got back from a laundry mat. So our washer works just fine, but our dryer, I swear our dryers go out like within months of having it, first purchasing it. It's so sad and I don't get it. I'm going to make my bed, wash the sheets, most of them. I mean, this is not a sheet, but the more blankets on my bed, the better. I want it like as comfortable as possible. I want to buy a new bed set, one that actually fits my bed. This is like for a king. I used to have a king bed before I had to move out. It's like really loose and kind of ugly. This is all I have. So this is as cute as it can get. Um, I don't know what happened to all my blankets I usually use. I do wish I could just like plop down on my stomach, but my boobs are filled with milk. Dark chocolate hummus. This is the first time I am seeing this. I don't know what you eat this with. What do you eat this with? We're getting it though. Um, I guess this is a new Taki flavor. They look very pale. And they kind of taste like cheesy. What is this? If you know what this is, put it in the comments. I'm gonna barf. It tastes like something familiar. I just don't know. It just looks like fucking milk cow pop soup. Like normally I wouldn't be so pushy on the back. I need it. Chocolate, peanut butter wafer. These would probably be so delicious frozen. Here's the white sauce thin crust. I thought you got that pizza. Like no, mom got this one. It's thin crust, it's white sauce, and it's really good. Spinach. Yeah, that really, I remember when dad used to get... This one is a deep dish. These are probably, honestly, the best store-bought pizzas we've ever had. Hey guys, today we're gonna do... Just kidding. I'm not gonna be one of those YouTubers, but... Hi guys, today I asked my mom to record me like a day in my life. Not actually like a day in my life, just like like just following me around for a day so you guys can deal with what I have to deal with every day, which is my internal monologue. But I'm going to outwardly display it for you guys to suffer with me. So today I decided to get a large iced coffee from McDonald's, even though I have crippling anxiety. I decided to traumatize myself today. Um, great start to the morning. And is it worth it? Yeah, if you're really like craving that burnt coffee, unchanged filter coffee taste. Anyways, 8.05. Fit for the morning. We have X situation ship eating. <laughs> and then we have this shirt from a girl who hates me. Um, this is the first shirt I ever wore when I drank alcohol for the first time and when my um, life went in a downward spiral. Slippers from the girl best friend who hates me. Pimple patches from my mom's baby daddy. Does anybody else love to wear like clothes that like they were traumatized in because it's like comforting? Or is it just me? Cause I don't know, I just, there's something about just wearing, wearing clothes that just, I don't know. One thing about me is I've been working Call me humble, call me like a functioning citizen of society, like despite my like crippling mental disabilities. But anyways, I've been working, so I got myself this coffee and that's my personality trait for the day, is this singular McDonald's iced coffee. And that will be my personality trait for the rest of the day. Um, I still don't drive. <laughs> Listen, baby steps. Listen, baby steps, I still don't drive, but guess what? I got a fucking job, so I don't want to hear it. So if she wants to like take me a little some something somewhere, that's up to her, but. My wrist is crippling. <laughs> <laughs> we should probably change out of the trauma fit because I feel like it might bring down my day. So I'm gonna get dressed, do my makeup, and then hopefully we can get something going, which is what the guy said to me at work the other day since I know you guys really want to know, I was serving this old man and he was like, he was like, what'd you do last weekend? And I was like, 
nothing. And he's like, what do you mean nothing? It was Saturday. You go dancing? I was like, no, nah, I don't dance. I, I didn't do anything. And he's like, hit my, hit <laughs> It was like, hit my line next week and we could get something going. And then he like winked or something and I was like, I'm gonna go do my makeup and I'll show you the finished look. Don't be startled when you think a new person took over my place and started recording. It's just the makeup guys, chill. Okay. Boom. We're done. Um, this. I got this little shirt from the thrift store and it says... <laughs> It says all American cutie and I just thought it was super funny. So we're in the car now. Um, we're gonna go to Savers and also I need to make a doctor's appointment because I put an earring in my ear and got a huge bump on my ear that's like swollen and infected. So don't ever use cheap jewelry. I'm eating a banana and peanut butter for breakfast. I drink all my coffee. One thing about me, I love baby utensils like i wish i could just always use baby spoons and forks but my mom gets are really you telling me you don't but my mom gets really mad are you literally telling me you don't well i do but not as much as i'd like to i have a phobia of wearing my own clothes like if it's my clothes i don't want to wear it but if it's anyone else's like i love putting it on my body it just i don't know i slept with my hair in a bun and it came out like this so if you guys want like a diy heatless blowout that's all you have to do hey guys so now we're at savers and we're just looking <laughs> like i feel like get my face in it oh like i feel like i would like i feel like i would accidentally hurt myself with this even though it's fake like there's not even real pokes but i would like still end up hurting myself somehow Oh my god, I need that. I genuinely need- like, it's not a want. Look at those beady ass eyes. Stop, because the- why would I actually look so good in this? Look at this. Oh my god, that is so ac- Get <laughs> my- really cute. This would look so cute on you guys, come on. Have you ever seen Spongebob? And on the back of like, the toilets- Okay, if you guys have watched Spongebob, on the back of the toilets in the Krusty Krab, they literally have these things. And I want one so- God. At my work, we have salad plates that are exactly like this. this That's is what, these are the serving sizes I should be eating. I literally have one of these in my Amazon. I'm thinking of just getting this and washing it really well because I need one and I want one now. Who's grandma? Who's grandma? This looks like something Aunt Lucy would give to Leah to wear to like a recital. Tremble at the sound. Does not give that? No. Oh my God. This just gave me flashbacks. To when I was in Suzuki the Musical, I wore like this exact same shirt. Do you remember that? And then this gave me flashbacks to work because it's literally my fucking uniform, just in a fancier form. That I like. This that is, is really cute. So pretty. I I really want a camo hoodie. Like I'm going to my roots. You know what I mean? This is so expensive, but I just know it would fit so good. Feel it. I got this camo hoodie because I'm just really trying to tap into my white girl, and I just feel like is that my mother? She scares me because she has like bright orange hair. I mean green. Look at it. There she is. Oh, she just disappeared. Sometimes think she's like a clown and it scares me. Oh, she just saw that. Oh, she's mad. <laughs> I put my hoodie on without washing it. I don't care if that's gross. I've shopped at the thrift store my whole life and I've done that my whole life. So you can shh. <laughs> Just like dancing because they're playing basic white boy druggy music in here. I'm from Utah, so hello. Okay, so we got garlic parmesan fries. We have blue cheese ranch, ranch blue cheese and honey mustard. And then in here we have some of these and some of these original hot and lemon pepper and then i have sprite and then my mom has i just got off my like six hour shift and we're at the grocery store i'm so tired guys so i just got baby carrot sticks and avocados and i don't know where my mom is never mind i found her i'm hungry i think it's gonna be the end of this video so thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed it's probably a little bit boring boo i told you guys don't get scared 
So, change of plans. Um, oh my god, I promise my nose isn't this. <laughs> I promise my nose isn't this big. I don't know what's going on with this face mask making my nose look huge, but it's not, right? Stop. I'm gonna have an identity crisis. So we're doing face masks right now. Go watch my mom's TikTok because we're doing masks for her TikTok. <laughs> 